Drain the air bottle to remove accumulated water. Drain water from the starting air line through drain cock. Drain the air cooler to check for any water accumulation. Keep the indicator cocks open. Fuel control level at start position and push the start button for blowing through the engine. Close the indicator cocks. Keep fuel control lever at run position and push the air start valve button to start the engine. Once the engine picks up on fuel, release the air start valve button. Relief valve. It is fitted on each air receiver. When the bottle pressure has reached 30 bar and the compressor is still running due to its faulty safety devices, the excess pressure in the bottle is released by the relief valve for the safety. Once the excess pressure is released, relief valve will get back to its original position. Safety plug. It is fitted in the starting air pipe and consists of a perforated plug protected by a sheet of material which will burst in case of excessive pressure caused due to airline explosion. Non-return valve. Positioned between the air manifold and air receiver, it will not allow the explosion and its mixture to reach the air bottle because of unidirectional property of non-return valve. Flame arrester. It is a small unit consisting of several tubes which will arrest any flame coming out of the cylinder through leaking start air valve. It is fitted on every cylinder before the start air valve.